In this video, we'll be showing you how to install the compression lug kits onto a power packed B frame circuit breaker. For this video, we are using the copper compression lug kit. However, there is also an aluminum compression lug kit that would be installed in the same way. Before installation, always make sure to consult the safety information and the instructions provided with the kit and never work on energized equipment. First, you'll remove the green connection system cover by putting a flathead screwdriver in this slot and then working it until it comes off of the breaker, like so. You will then remove the lug kit that is currently on the breaker by sticking a small flathead screwdriver into the slot below the lug kit and leveraging the lug kit out of the breaker. Like so. You'll need to install the terminal nut kit which would either be ordered separately or already installed on the breaker with a termination letter F in the third position of the breaker part number. You will put this notch into the grooves in the back of the breaker and then press down until it clicks into place. At this point, you would slide the heat shrink sleeve onto the conductor and then slide the conductor into the compression lug and then crimp the lug as specified in the instructions. Then slide the sleeve into place and use a heat source to shrink it around the lug and conductor. Alternate ways of isolating the conductors are by using the interphase barriers or the long terminal shield. Normally this would be crimped and the heat shrink sleeve would be on it but for the purposes of this video we will be showing it as so. You would then place the compression lug against the terminal nut and use the screw provided with the terminal nut kit to tighten it into place with a 4 millimeter or 532nd inch hex drive. Lastly, you would reinstall the green connection system cover. And now you have everything installed on the breaker and ready to use.